Well, I think it was a mistake for Governor Pritzker to sign House Bill 3653, both on a policy level and a leadership level. First, on the policy side, this is a bill that the overwhelming majority of law enforcement professionals in the state of Illinois were adamantly opposed to. This is a bill that is going to make our communities and our families less safe. On the leadership side, I would have vetoed this just because it was not passed in a transparent manner. And that goes for any piece of legislation, whether I like it or dislike it. If it is not passed in a transparent manner, following the proper processes where people can weigh in, know what is in the bill, and have time to analyze it before a final vote, I'm going to veto that legislation. We have to get back to good government in Illinois in the process by which House Bill 3653 being amended up until the very last minute and passed in the Illinois Senate at 4 a.m. with senators not even knowing what was in there. That is a failure of our process and that should have been, that should have led to a veto just because it was so poorly drafted and the process was so bad alone. So Sheriff, do you have any, any comments about how this is gonna make your, uh, your mission more or less difficult? You know, unfortunately, it's, it's, it's the most anti-law enforcement legislation that I've seen in 20 years of, of my experience. Uh, it's severely tying hands of, of law enforcement officers. Uh, it's unfortunate. I mean, all of law enforcement uh, would strive and work with the state legislature to include the governor's office uh, to do our job better. Uh, there's nothing to say that we can't do our job better. We, and we, I look forward to, to working with uh, Mr. Shemp in the future. Uh, and, and, and neither the Sheriff's Association or the Chief of Police Association or the FOP, uh, none of these organizations were, had any, any involvement or any input in any of this. And, and it's really going to affect citizens' lives in a negative way. And uh, I truly hope we can, can work on this in the future. Uh, for the future of the state. Well, a lot of times uh, people will say, oh, there's no difference between the candidates. Uh, you know, the, my choices are just the same. This is an example of how that is not true. This is a bright line difference between Governor Pritzker and myself. I vehemently disagree with the policy behind this legislation, but also as your governor, I will not be signing any legislation that is not passed in a transparent manner. So that is a huge difference between the way I would act as governor and the way that Governor Pritzker is currently acting right now.